similar to uh, crank nicholson and uh, bender excluded method uh, how we solve one dimensional wave equation so in this lecture i will explain how we solve one dimensional wave equation numerically uh, means by explicit method how we solve and that is uh, easy only so in general what is one dimensional heat equation is uh, wave equation is a square del square y del x square So how we solve this uh, one dimensional wave equation numerically? So for that purpose, uh, we took one question and then I will explain. Procedure is very similar to what we did in last, means in crank Nicholson and uh, bender excluded method. So same type we will do here. It's very simple. So always, H given. So once H given, you have to calculate K and K value here given by the formula H by A. So whatever H is there, find out A and find out K. Once you know uh, K means increment in T and H means increment in X. So once you know H and K, so you can go for table easily for first row. You can create easily then based on given boundary condition, we will put the value. And then I will tell how we calculate rest all values. That is also very simple and within time frame we can do. So uh, let's start. We start with the one question which is given. Uh, we have to solve del square y del t square is equal to del square y del x square x 0 to 1 and t always positive at time means always positive and satisfies the boundary condition y x comma 0 is equal to 0 del y by del t x comma 0 is equal to 0 y 0 t is equal to 0 and y 1 t is equal to 1 by 2 sin pi t Compute y x t for four time steps with the h value given how much one by four. So h value given and this boundary condition given. So you know already uh, it means uh, when x value zero, what is t value? zero only when x value one what is t value this one only and uh, when x value x what is y value zero only so this is given so how we solve it's very simple first you calculate k value here what is a value a value given one Correct because uh, a is square one, so a is one. A is one, so what is k value? H by a. So k is also uh, one by four, means 0.25. Correct. 
So K and H both are 0.25. Here x, here t, as usual, x starting from 0 and goes up to 1. And what is increment? 0.25. So increment in x means 0, 0 0.25, then 0 0.50, then 0 0.75, and then 1. Similarly, in t, what is increment? This one only. So starting is 0, then 0 0.25, 0 0.50, 0 0.75, then 1. This is 4 time step. Correct. 1, 2, 3, 4. Yeah, 4 time steps. Now, we will put the values. It's simple. Nothing is there. No need to learn anything. Easily you can see. See, what is the boundary condition given? Y, 0, T is equal to 0. So when x value 0, t value 0, correct? So means x 0 here, so all t values will be 0 only. Because t value means we put in column wise. And x value means row wise. What is next given? y 1 comma t is given by 1 by 2 sin pi t. Correct. So, when t value 0, so 1 t means this one, this column we are going to fill. So, when t value 0, so sin 0 is 0. So, 0. When t value 1 by 4, 1 by 4 means when T value 1 by 4. What is Y value? One by two. Sine five by four. So this is a Sin pi by 4 means uh, 1 by root 2. Sin 45 means 1 by 2 root 2. And uh, it, when you simplify, I think it will come 0 0.3536. This is 0 0.3536. Similarly, when x is 1 by 2, 1 by, uh, t is 1 by 2 means sin 91, 1 by 2.5. Sorry, point seven five. It will come zero point three five three six. Uh, at one, it will be zero because sine pi sine pi is zero. So this value we calculated. Now, uh, what is given? Next boundary condition y x comma zero is equal to zero. Correct. So it means first row when x value t value 0, this one we can put. Huh? So y always 0. So this 0, this is 0, this is 0. Now we have to calculate remaining value. So remaining means a, b, c. First we calculate this one. First row after that, remember. Uh, after this is your first row, this is second row. 
So second row always we can calculate by same procedure. Whatever A is there, A means take this diagonal, this diagonal and average. So 0 plus 0 by 2 means 0 only. What is B? B also 0. C also 0 because average of this. Use always that one. Means diagonal average. Diagonal average. What about this one? From third row onwards. Remember, third row on, onwards. Suppose we are going to calculate this A. Correct? So this A, how we calculate? Remember, it's very simple, uh, but don't be confused. So this A means, how we calculate? This diagonal plus second diagonal means this one. Minus, not just above, last above means uh, this, this value. Means just above you leave and take next above means this zero minus this one zero. What is the value? Zero. How we calculate this one? How we calculate this one? This one plus this one minus this. This which also comes zero. What is this? This one plus this one minus this. So it will come 0 0.3536. Correct now? Because this value is 3, this one plus this one minus this one. Now, how we calculate this one? 0 plus 0 minus 0. So it will come to 0 only. This one, 0 plus this minus 0. So it will come 0. Point 3536 and uh, this one means 0 plus 0 0.5 so it will become 0 0.5 okay now this one how we calculate 0 plus this minus this so it will come 3536 this one 0 plus this minus this means it will come 0 0.5 and how this one comes 0 0.3536 this one minus this one so it will come 0 0.3536 over so this is the way how we calculate uh, how we solve a uh, wave equation using this method. This is very easy method. Again, I, I will explain. See, uh, first row means initial row you can calculate by given condition. Then first row almost it is given, so you can put by the given condition. Second row you use the average of diagonal values. Means suppose this one, this one, then take this diagonal, this diagonal, average. Second row, you calculate just diagonal average value. From third row onwards, you take diagonal, add both the diagonal, minus, uh, just last above. Means this one above, and before that, what is that? This one this value minus this one for suppose we are going to calculate this one now i will uh, tell in this one box type suppose we are going to calculate this one so take this diagonal this diagonal means diagonal and not this one this box just above go for this box minus this one so this, this plus this minus this. Understand? 
So this one plus this 